sits there still and keeps trucking like the blue dog man together. All that's in life, just keep trucking. That music will get you going. Always so good to see you. Sherry Torcos is back. She is the holistic pharmacist, and we haven't seen you in a while. How you been? That's right. I've been doing good. Thank you. Very yeah, good. You're working really on good. a bunch of different Busy things. Busy with my book and uh, out uh, doing it's some uh, promotions with the book, book signings, lectures, and seminars. You are a busy body. This I is am. available in all bookstores all as well as your website. Stores. That's right. Very cool. Yeah. And we have a whole bunch of different supplements here. We're, we're of course separating fact from fiction again. There's so much information yes. when it comes to this, which is why we're so lucky to have you on. First up, we already alluded to this with Kev. Take the daily supplement. Yeah. You hear different things. Some people say if you eat a well balanced diet, you don't need it. What's your take? Well, I think if you are eating a ton of fresh fruits and vegetables and they're organic, you may be able to get enough nutrients through your diet. But if you're occasionally eating fast foods, skipping meals, if you're exposed to stress, pollution, or smoking, medication. if you're taking medication, birth control pills, cholesterol lowering drugs, they deplete nutrients in your body, diuretics. Mm. So I think it is important to take a good multi as, you know, really the foundation of your supplement program. So just taking a, a one a day, there's some formulas where you take three or four a day, it's a little bit more difficult to comply to, but I think a, one, a good one a day is a good idea. And there are so many segmented types, some for women, some for men. Some exactly, for and you should look for a supplement that's geared towards your gender, your age, your activity level, and any existing health conditions you, you have in the morning with food? With meals. Depends. Uh, some people have a weak stomach in the morning and they don't like to eat a lot. So if you're not eating a lot for breakfast, then I would take it with lunch because okay. you want to have it with some food. I want to skip really quickly to this because yeah, I, I just munched on it and I've been <laughs> sampling throughout the break. I've got to say this is delicious. It's Isn't got it? like a wafery, crispy, coffee yeah. beanie, bittery taste to it. These are actual shredded cocoa beans, That's cocoa right. nibs. It's, they're cocoa pieces and it's pure organic cocoa pieces. And the reason I brought that is there's been some studies to show that consuming cocoa extract, which is available either as a food or you'll find it in supplements as well, can help increase uh, your protection from the sun. So given really? that, you know, it's summertime, we're looking at ways to um, take care of our skin, promote good skin health. Uh, cocoa, having some of the pure cocoa extract, taking supplements, that's the healthy skin, has lycopene. Uh, and no, also this that's is not one serving. This is not no, one serving. No, that's not one serving. You no. know, but you can cook with it. You can just sprinkle it on your cereal, enjoy it. Um, also the lycopene, I brought some uh, tomatoes here. Uh, tomatoes contain this antioxidant called lycopene, and lycopene has been found to provide uh, sun protection. It actually gives you an SPF of about five, okay. meaning if you eat a lot of tomatoes, like five tomatoes a day, or take one of those lycopene capsules, it'll help increase your, your protection Natural from protection the sun. protection from within, but you'd yeah, have exactly. to eat this many raw tomatoes. You would. You'd have to, and they have to be vine ripened as well. So, you know, if you're, this time of year, I mean, I grow tomatoes in my garden. I eat a couple a day. I probably wouldn't have five a day. Mm -hmm. um, but if you're looking for the protection for your skin and also lycopene's good for the guys, for prostate health, then you may want to take a supplement. And the good news is it's actually concentrated That's in right. pastes, sauces, and even ketchup. That's right, because processing of tomatoes increases um, the release of the, of the oils, which increases the lycopene content. Okay. Do we have yeah. to worry about expiry dates when it comes to yeah, supplements? definitely want to look at your labels. Um, look at expiry dates, for example. You'll always see the lot number and the expiry date on the side of a bottle, so okay. you want to take a look at that. What's the average shelf um, life? It depends on the product. Some products, for example, fish oils don't have a lo as long of a shelf life as others. For example, if I take a look at this one, it expires in April 2009, and mm. this is a uh, omega-369, which is also good for skin health this time of year. Um, so you want to take a look at that. And the other thing to look at with the labels, I brought some garlic extracts. Uh, Health Canada now regulates claims on labels, so consumers can have greater confidence if it says that it does a particular thing, it, it actually offers the benefits. Uh, this particular aged garlic extract, the Kyolic, actually has been shown to reduce the risk of cardiovascular disease, yeah. and they're actually one of the sponsors of the Ride for Heart. So if it's in the family, do you recommend people take it? when they're in their 20s or at what point should you start well, that? you know what, we start to form plaque in our blood vessels in the first decade of life. It starts mm. to get laid down in our blood vessels. Genetically. By the time you're 20, 30, 40, most people don't have an episode, and when I say episode, heart attack, stroke, until they're in their 50s or 60s. But the process starts early, so if you're interested in heart disease protection, start soon. Start when you're in your teens and 20s. Exercise, eat healthy, 
uh, Kyolic, the garlic supplement, also antioxidants can be helpful. All of that makes a big difference. Is that one tablet a day? Uh, this is uh, one a day for prevention, but for people that have existing heart disease, high cholesterol, I'd okay. recommend two a day. Uh, what's unique about that, I've got my, my little garlic bulbs there as well. Uh, the garlic bulb, of course, gives us garlic breath, but if you take the supplement, it's actually odorless, so you won't uh, offend anybody <laughs> with, That's really with your point. garlic breath. And in stark contrast to the sun protecting effects of the lycopene, you brought in the St. John's wort. How yes, come? I did. And the reason I brought that in is there are actually certain supplements and also medications that can increase your risk of burning, increase sun sensitivity. And one is St. John's wort, used for mild to moderate depression. Uh, if you're taking that, it can increase your likelihood of getting a sunburn, so be careful. Also, if you're taking high doses of vitamin A, certain antibiotics such as tetracycline, be very careful this time of year. Uh, wear your wide brim hat, sunscreen, mm. or, or just stay out of the sun. Extra sensitive. And finally, the green tea. Yeah, green tea. The reason I brought that, people that are interested in uh, staying slim over the summer months, uh, there's been some evidence to show green tea can help increase metabolism, prevent weight gain. You can get it in either capsule form or in the tea, about five to ten cups a day. Oh, that's a but lot. But the other thing with green tea, antioxidants help reduce heart problems, increase protection against a lot of chronic diseases. One of the best beverages that you can enjoy Sherry, for health. Great info as always. Pick this up. The encyclopedia is right here and in bookstores or on the website cherrytorcos.com for all the information. Thank you so much. Yeah, I love chatting with you. Me. And thanks fun. for bringing in my favorite new yeah, snack. Well, enjoy. Have some. <laughs> Cocoa nibs. Don't mind if I do. Over to Kevin in the newsroom. They're so good. Yeah, they are good. Well,